guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be a Primark haul. I haven't shopped in Primark in a while, I haven't done a Primark video in a very long time as well. So I have been watching Primark hauls on YouTube lately and I felt like I haven't seen any that like on me or things that I would wear. So I felt like I'd take a trip in there myself and see what I could find that suits my style. So hopefully if you are or have a similar style to me or you like my style and what I find in Primark then I hope you guys will enjoy this video. I'm not gonna lie there actually wasn't that many things and I feel like maybe it's because it's a whole like sale they're in between sales and stuff that I don't know they just have an off month I don't know but I'm gonna show you what I got anyway I just went into my local one because I just could not be bothered to go into Central at the minute so Yes, I'm going to show you what I got. We're going to jump straight into it. I do have two bags before, so I did manage to find quite a bit, or a few things anyway. So, the first thing that I'm going to start with is this jacket. I got this in a size 12. It literally was the only one sitting there anyway, so <laughs> and that's why I did get in a size 12. But it fits really good. This was at £23, and it's just a camel coat. So it looks like that, just long lined. There's a girl that I follow on Instagram, Lorna Lux, and she just has such an amazing style. And she like had this coat with kind of like a black jumper, white shirt tucked underneath. It just looked really, really cool. So it, this jacket like reminded me of her. So I wanted to pick this up. And for £23, I think that's quite a good price. It's not the like the thickest of coats, but I've got it in a bigger size so I can wear and I plan to wear like jumpers or like I think a black hoodie underneath would look really good as well. What this little bag, how cute is this? How cute? I probably can't even fit anything in it, maybe my phone, just about, but it was only £2 in the sale, it was originally 4 and I just thought that was so adorable so it, it's like... Um, just a crossbody bag and it's adjustable you guys know how I love adjustable bags so I can wear it like higher up I love wearing crossbody bags like literally about here I think looks so good so um yes I picked up that it's so cute it's just in a nude color my vibe <laughs> so the second clothing item I got a pair of skinny fit joggers so they just look like this in a nude color so just slim fit. I got this in an X, extra small, which they say is a six to eight, because I want this to be quite fitted on me, especially like around like the waist and the hips. I want it to be like fitted. And then if I have like a little bit of bag on the leg, I won't mind. But the whole idea of them is to be fitted. That's why I got that in an extra small. So hopefully like my vision comes to life. These were only five pounds as well and it came in different colors. I think there was black, which I feel like I should have got the black. And I think I saw khaki as well. So um, next thing I got is another pair of straight high-waisted jeans. I feel like I already have a pair of straight jeans. These are Zach ones, I feel like. I'm not quite sure, I need to double check actually. But I think this is a different wash. But I love Primark jeans, I think they're really nice. They fit really well as well. I got these in a size eight because I have put on a little bit of weight. So I don't feel like a size six is gonna fit me anymore or the sixes that I have at the minute are a little bit tight. So I sized up. So yeah, these were £13, so really good price. Again, straight raw hem denim jeans. Two jumpers. Um, same jumper, just two different colours. Um, the first one I got in a small because that's all they had. This was £13 and it's just a really pale roll neck jumper. <laughs> Oversized roll neck, so I just need to get more jumpers in my life. I really need a black one. I cannot for the life of me find a black roll neck jumper, which is so weird to me and so strange that like nowhere has them. But yeah, I got this one. It's kind of like an oatmeal colour. And then I also got it in this colour. 
Look at this. Look at it. <laughs> um, so it's a neon pink roll neck. I already have a neon green one, but I felt like pink would look really cute, especially with my hairstyle at the minute. I got this one in a medium, which is a 12 to 14, because I did want it to be quite slouchy, oversized. I think maybe with like denim or even like leather trousers would look really cool. And then this one, mm, I'm not sure about this. I feel like it looks kind of cheap actually, but I'm not sure. I need to try it on. This I got in an extra small, which is six to eight. This was six pounds. And it's again, another neon pink, like roll neck top, but it's like a fitted one. So it's like a ribbed slinky material. And then it has like the circle zip. I love like the contrast, like with the black zip on show as well. So you can just wear that up or down. I probably wear it as low as I possibly can. Um, for it to look kind of like cool and a little bit of sexy edge to it. Then the last thing that I got is this cropped jacket. Jacket. So it's a a coat slash jacket, a shirt slash jacket. Jacket. Um, um. So yeah, I got this in an extra small, six to eight. It was fourteen pounds. It also had this in like the camo print. But I don't know, I felt like khaki, just plain khaki would look cool. So it's just cropped. I hope it's cropped, should be anyway. That's why I kind of went down in the size so that it would actually be cropped on me. So um, yeah, looks like this, just a khaki kind of like thin jacket. Just to wear, like just thrown on. I know it's freezing at the minute, but I felt like if you go somewhere, you're going to take your jacket off, you still need to have a like a good outfit going on underneath your coat so even if I wore this and then had a coat on top but something underneath it as well so maybe I would wear this open with a roll neck is that doing too much I don't know we'll see how I sell this up I got like random bits and bobs so I got nail files because I was going through like my bot drawers like my makeup drawers and like my nail polishes and stuff and I don't have nail files and I feel like as a girl or a woman I should have nail files and I like I don't know so yeah I picked up that that was a pound for eight and then um I do have tweezers but um I don't know I just felt like I needed another pair because I always lose the ones that I have I only have one so I thought I'd get a set of tweezers so it has like the normal size one and then like the really really skinny one so that was a pound as well i got some jewelry bits quite a few jewelry bits actually because with my new hairstyle i feel like i need to wear earrings all the time whereas like before i have like hair before i used to have like middle part with my hair down you couldn't really see my ears so i just kind of like get away with wearing a hoop maybe or wearing nothing but with my hair all back ears on show I need to have them looking presentable so I picked up like a bunch of earrings so I got a 20 pack which just has little studs um I've got like wait it's one one two three four five so it's got like five no wait it's got one two three it's got four earrings four different style earrings but then it has like five different sizes in them so like small all the way to like a bigger one um, this was £3. I'll do a close-up and then I'll show you them in my ears as well because I've actually opened up all of my holes in my ears. So I'm super happy about that. I've got three on each side and then I've got this side one, I don't know what it's called, and I've got up hair down as well. And then I got this set of like little hoops which were £1.50. I probably wouldn't recommend these to be honest because they are a B to like put in. But I wanted, like for my side and for the up here one, I wanted them to be like the hoops. Like, you know, when people wear hoops, I think they look more edgy as a piercing. And like, it's the, it's the size that I needed. But I kind of, I'm going to look for a better, I don't know, a better pair or better earrings. But yeah, I wouldn't recommend this basically. But I, you can't return earrings and I've already worn some anyway, so... Um, another earrings that I've got, as you do all the time, is just the kind of like crystally studs, 
one pound cannot go wrong you get what six different sizes in there so if any time I want to switch it up and have silver or like like little diamantes or something then I will reach with these ones and then I got two necklaces so the first one that I got is a letter just my initial S I already have like a much bigger one from ASOS but this one is much smaller and I just thought it looked really cute so this was two pounds so the last jewelry bit that I got is this necklace and I just thought it was so cute it's two pounds and it just says Aries on it so that's that's my star sign I'm an Aries so it has Aries written on it and then it has like my actual the sign I guess the horoscope sign so um yeah I just thought that was cute I don't know if they're separate and you can like wear them separately. If you can, then I'll probably just wear the Aries part, but I just thought that was really, really nice. That is everything that I picked up in Primark that I wanted to share with you. I hope you guys enjoyed it and you've seen something that you actually like from my video because I felt like there was no videos out there at the minute that suited me and my style and what piece of fluff that I would go and buy in Primark. So yeah, hope I've given you some inspiration and you enjoyed it so give it a thumbs up if you did make sure you're subscribed and follow me on my social media accounts and i will catch you on my next one bye